<laughs> Kids come up to the truck and they say, I want some sour. And I say, how much sour do you want? We have different kinds of sour, different levels of sour. And they say, well, what sour do you have? And I say, a little sour, some sour, sort of sour, mega sour, mighty sour, awesome sour, super sour, giga sour, atomic sour, and fall on your knees crying to your mama sour. <laughs> which which one do you want? Like and so they go, medium. Uh, 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 yeah, they and they'll say, well, I want, I want, I want the one in the middle, and we, I say, we don't have that one. We have a little sour, 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 some sour, mega sour, mighty sour, awesome sour, super sour, giga sour, atomic sour, falling on your knees, crying to your mom's sour. You know, right? Yeah. So, oh my God! And they'll say, I want the one at the end. We don't have that one. We have a little sour, some sour, 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 mega sour, mighty sour, awesome sour, super sour, giga sour, atomic sour, falling. We uh, got into Kona about two years ago. I was sitting on the couch looking through franchise portal websites and it just popped and I called Angela over and said hey you got to come see this this is unique there's nothing like it in our area it just looks like it would work here and I think we need to check it out I started to explore the normal business opportunities schools and daycares and all that kind of stuff and I went up to get the final licensing done with the city of Greenville and one of the guys that I was uh, doing the licensing with was so impressed he was like you got to go over to the zoo and, and just show them your truck and see if they'll hire you to do something. We are a small community zoo we have lions here at the zoo we have giraffes which you see behind me we have a little giraffe family we are one of the few zoos to have Amir leopards they're one of the most or the most endangered large cat they are beautiful animals. I pull up behind the administration building and as I'm pulling in there's this crowd of people coming out of the building. And uh, I turn the music on, pulled up and they're looking at me like, what in the world is this? And uh, the guy in charge started walking over the truck and I didn't know if he was going to kick me out of the place or shake my hand. So I rolled down my window, the music's playing. And uh, he said, uh, Can you, who are you? And I said, well, I'm Scott Mackey, and I'm with Kona Ice. And I shook his hand, and I said, do you have a minute where I can talk to you? And he said, well, well yeah, j I've got just a minute. Um, in fact, we've just been in a meeting talking about ways that we can improve the zoo. And uh, I think we need to talk to you. At the zoo, they had been working with a, a nasty old ice cream truck. When he saw Kona Ice, the animals on the side of the truck, the cleanliness, um, I hope I presented myself in a friendly way, it was just a no-brainer for him. And they had had that nasty ice cream truck contract for 10 years. And he immediately said, we're going to end that contract, work through the city, and get you in here at the zoo in Cleveland Park. Our experience with Kona Ice started about a year and a half to two years ago um, when we met Scott and we have had an awesome relationship since then. Um, we actually have kind of a partnership where Kona Ice gives back. They were actually able to give us over $11,000 this past year, which is wonderful. We've just really had a great relationship. It's a wonderful, family-friendly business. The kids love it. Um, everyone always has good things to say about Kona Ice. So it really, it's been great. And last year we gave back, uh, ju I think just under $12,000. And this year we, it looks like we're going to be about 10 or 15% higher than our give back last year. The money goes to any improvements that the animals need and any of the, uh, any of the basics. Animal food, veterinary care, any medicine, improvements to their exhibits, heat lamps for our reptile exhibits, our UV light for them. We have a little sour, some sour, sort of sour, mega sour, mighty sour, awesome sour, super sour, giga sour, atomic sour, and falling on your knees crying to your mama sour. I'll take the first one. Little sour, some sour, sort of sour, mega sour, mighty sour, awesome sour, super sour, giga sour, atomic sour, and falling on your knees crying to your mama sour. What about medium? We don't have medium. Here's the atomic list. Atomic sour? Atomic sour. We got that one. We like being partners with the zoo because our zoo is very tied into our community and we feel like our money is going directly into something that benefits our community. We have these children that are coming behind us and we want to be an example to them of responsible parents, responsible members of our community, of Christian people. And one of the things that we do as a family is we give. So we want them to see what it, it is to us and how important it is. I do it because it's fun. 
Uh, we get to see these incredible smiles and hear these incredible thank yous. And we want Kona to be a reputable business in our community. We want people in the Greenville area to say, oh, Kona, they're fantastic, they're great. They're not just trying to make money. They're trying to be a significant influence in this community for good. And that's what we try to do as a family, that's what we want to do as a Kona franchise.